hello everyone welcome to rick's ideas and in this tutorial i'm going to show you how you can generate random uuid in wix and these are unique ids that do not replicate themselves and it's also a system that wix uses to display user ids or member ids wix also uses it in almost all the apps they have like for example the blogs the wix store and many more so they use this kind of ids because of the length and if you try to combine this it's quite impossible to regenerate the same kind of id twice and you have a huge amount of times that you can use this so you can generate ids in billions and this is a lot all right so i'm going to also show you the same way you can generate such ids and how you can also use them for any kind of operation in your wix code now before we get started please don't forget to smash that subscribe button give this video a like and also also, don't forget to turn on your bell notification to be the first to know of future videos. You can also comment down below to let me know if you have any questions. Now, first of all, I'm going to start off with the design and the elements that I'm going to be using for this. And right now, I already have a design and what I want it to do. I have a box element here with a text inside of it. And this is the text that's going to hold the unique IDs. I also have a button element here as well that is going to help me generate the unique IDs. So what I want is when the user clicks on this, it's going to generate the ids but this is not the only use case this is just an example to show you how this can be done but you can also use this method when you're trying to give your site visitors a unique experience so you might have a need for unique id and you want something that does not repeat itself something that you can use a bunch of time now the first thing we want to do over here is to turn on our dev mode most of the things we're going to be working on in this website are going to be coded now first of all let's go ahead and minimize this and head over to the code packages we're going to go over to the npm and we're going to install a special npm called the uuid so go over to search for any package from npm and search for uuid now this is the one that we're looking for which is the version 9.0.0 and it's mit so go ahead and install that and once you have installed that click on view this is going to open up a readme folder which you can see and understand what you need to do with it so let's close up this section and let's navigate back to our page so now let's start off our page by writing a function that is going to generate this id for us now first of all let's go back to this readme and then let's go ahead and copy this section now this is how we import the package to our wix website and this is the package that is going to generate our id now i mentioned that this id can be generated a lot of times and it's quite almost slightly impossible to generate the id twice but it is not impossible so what we need to do is that we need to make sure that it has to be impossible to generate the id twice and to do that we need to create something called a set which is like a box that is going to hold all the generated ids so the ids do not repeat themselves so let's go ahead and say the uuid set and here we're going to create a new set so again this is like a box that is going to hold all the ids that the site has generated right and then next we're going to create a function that is actually going to return the id that has been generated so this function i'm going to call it generated unique id amazing and then inside of this generated unique id function we're going to create another variable which is the variable that holds the id itself so let's go ahead and call this generated id now this can be anything that you want it to be but i'm going to name it in a way that you can understand what i'm actually doing here and then we're going to assign this to the uuid that we created and we're going to use the version 4 which is the latest version that they've released and over here you can see that this is the id and then at the end of the day we want to go ahead and return the generated id that means that this function now holds the generated id but then what we want to do is that we still want to use the new set in order for us to make sure that we save all the generated ids inside of the set and so that id will not be generated again now let's go ahead and use a while loop to do this now our while loop has a condition and the condition that we want to do is that we want to check our uuid set and we're going to check if this set already has the generated id then we're going to go ahead and generate a new id with the variable that we've just created and then we're going to go ahead and add that generated id into our set so let's go ahead and add our new set and then we're going to add the generated id amazing so this looks like we're pretty much done but next we need to add an click event to our button element that is going to help us to generate this id like i did in this section here so first of all let's click on this button element here 
and go over to the properties panel which you can toggle on and off from here as you can see i already gave this a name which is generate button so you can name yours what you want so i'm going to copy that and bring it over here and here i'm going to add an unclick function to this button element and then inside of this unclick function i'm going to add this text i'm going to continually change this text to the generated id and the id for this text is uuid so let's just add a text so that we can know what that is and we can copy that to this section and here i'm going to use the wix selector to select this text and i am going to assign a value to the text property of this text element and i'm going to be using a template leader row to display this id so instead of this template leader row i'm going to add this section and i'm going to add this uuid so here you can copy the function and place it right there and then once you're done let's go ahead and preview and see how this works now over here if you click on this generate you can see that it continually generates random ids that you can always copy and use now let's take a look at these on the live side let's publish our sites and then let's view these on the live site so over here you are able to generate new uuids on wix so this is how you generate a universally unique identifier in your wix website and if you know that this tutorial was helpful please let me know in the comment section and also don't forget to smash that subscribe button so that every use wix user can find this tutorial and also find it useful thank you very much for viewing and i will see you in the next tutorial